Cash Jam, and I'm here with Eddie Rodriguez of the Connected Culture Show, and I'm going to let him take over at this point. Well, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. I'm here doing some behind-the-scenes footage just for you guys. I want you to check this out. Just before the festivity starts at about 8 o'clock, exactly at 8 o'clock, we got a little jam going on right now. This is just some warm-up, but I'm here checking all this out. These are the uh, instrumentations and everything else. That's here up on stage. You guys are just warming up. Again, you got uh, quite a few people. You're all invited to come down with my Facebook family. It's at 30, 31 East Tool. 31 East Tool. And uh, this will be the jam session uh, starting at 8 o'clock. This is just a warm up they're doing. So just stay tuned. My name is Eddie Rodriguez, producer and host of the Connecting Culture Show. <coughs> Waiting for you guys to come down. You're all invited. Okay? You're all invited to come down and check everything out. All right? beautiful art done here. This is the Ultra Cultural Art Center. For those of the art lovers, come on down and check this out. This is absolutely beautiful. A lot of, a lot of new creation. Absolute beautiful design. A lot of culture, a lot of art. Besides the music. Back to Facebook. Back to Facebook. Back to Facebook. Meditation room. So people are invited to come down. They're just starting to walk in now. out all the culture, all the artists that have associated themselves with this art gallery here. The Solar Culture Gallery, 31 East Tool. Check out all this stuff. And general. Think. Isn't that gorgeous? Look at
invited to come down to Sona. Gentlemen, we're here at the Solar Culture Center, right by Galactic Center. You're all invited to come down to Sonin's. We're at 31 East Tool, the Solar Culture Center. Jazz. Come down and jam. Truly no cover, but there is a day. I mean, if you decide to bring a donation, bring a donation down. So far here every Monday, this is our second Monday, to enjoy some jazz creation from different folks as they come down and enlighten their jazz experience right here. You're invited as well. to share all the creative culture that's on the wall, all the art creation. This mixture of music and jazz and culture of art is a part of the universe 
the mathematical universe that's called music <laughs> of all kinds, truly of all kinds. Come and meet that experience with us. My name is Eddie Rodriguez, producer and host of the Connecting Culture Show. And as you can tell, I, I go everywhere. <laughs> jazz, jazz, salsa, Latin, music, reggae banda. Wherever there is a culture of any kind of music, I'll be there. Bringing it to you guys, so enjoy yourselves.
Well, ladies and gentlemen, I'm here at the Solar Culture Center, 31 East Tool. All the two Tucsonans close by, come on down, even if you're a little bit further. You got a car? Come on down. Donations at the door. But this is live, live jazz. Creative jazz, solar jazz. By that I mean that the universe, there's no limit to what is being uh, invented here shared here directly from Tucson, Arizona. Hacienda Linda here. Hi, sweetheart. How are you? And we're live. Glad to see you. I haven't seen you in a while. <laughs> we were talking outside earlier, yeah. <laughs> nice. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we hope you're having some awakening. That's what I call it. This is the universe is wide open and so is this jazz session here at Solar Culture. A new wave of jazz created on the spot by musicians that have been around for quite a bit, myself included. But I'm here shooting video tonight, otherwise I'd be up there myself too. It's okay. My contribution is right here behind this screen, bringing it to you like I have for 11 years with Connecting Culture Show. Enjoy.
Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> Eddie Rodriguez here, bringing you the jazz. Thank you, Eddie. Thank you. Welcome to the second weekly Tucson Eclectic Jazz Jam. We're glad you could join us. Anybody's welcome, any instrument, any style, no pre-configured instrumentation. And welcome to requests, and we already had our first request. Is Michael G in the house still? Yeah. Michael G wanted to right do uh, something for my father. So, so. Do you want to go? By the way, if you don't know Michael G, he's a, a, a citizen of Green Valley, resident of Green Valley, and he's a, he's a wonderful musician. He played in LA for years and years, had a steady gig in Beverly Hills, eventually became an owner of the club, uh, bought uh, his house in Green Valley with his musician's earnings, <laughs> and he's an he's a example for all of us. He often plays at Phil Davis's jazz session every Sunday at Brother John's Beer, Bourbon, and Barbecue from 3 to 6. You play there, right? Yeah. Uh, no, 6 to 3. So the other thing I wanted to tell you is I'll be there with him on the, on the 29th. They hired me to play. Phil Davis hired me, so I'll be over there on the 29th. It's a Sunday. But every Sunday you can hear him. And we're going to do a song by Horse Silver. Song for my father. It's called Song for My Father. Anyone who wants to can play, you don't have to sign up, just get your horn and blow, all right? We're about ready to start this next song. Oh, and there's that cooler over there is drinks for anybody who wants it. There's nothing alcoholic, just sodas. And it's mostly out of ice, but help yourself anything in that styrofoam cooler on the floor over there. If you guys want one, just reach out through the screen and grab one. <laughs> okay, hopefully you're liking this.
Rockabilly.
Ladies and gentlemen, Thank you song for my father, featuring Mr. Michael, Michael G. Michael G. Is a composer that we lost a few years ago, a great composer, so it's great to, great to do that song. Yeah. Thank you, Quinn. Is that Brian Hicks back there? The back row? No, but we got Tony Spears. It looks like him. <laughs> Tony, you want to, you want to play? Feel free, man. Come on up. Well, ladies and gentlemen, here, 31 East Tool, two Sonnets come down. There's still people are starting to show up here more and more. Freestyle, any style, any instrument. You're welcome to bring it. Come on down and join the jam session. We got a request from Malik Alkabir to do giant steps as a bossa nova. Well, there's some interesting giant steps as a bossa nova. Bossa nova, bossa nova. Well, for you jazz lovers, there is creation happening right here for you guys. Here it goes.
there, ladies and gentlemen.
Well, ladies and gentlemen, another fine creation. We're here. All right, that was Giant Steps, that is a bossa nova. And I've always heard that it works really well as a bossa nova, but it might be my first time ever performing as a bossa nova. So thanks for requesting that, Malik. That request came from Malik Alkabir and the tenor sax. Not everybody knows the story of Malik Alkabir, how he was born in Morocco and then raised in Philadelphia, studied as a child with the principal oboe player in the Philadelphia Orchestra. And with his ingenuity, he transferred his oboe technique to saxophone and then proceeded to tour Europe, lived in Europe for a number of years. He's performed with Peggy Lee, he's performed with TSOP, The Sound of Philadelphia. He's on three Anthony Braxton albums. How about a hand for Malik Alkabir? The Alkabirian legend. He's also a world class pianist. And um, we have, I'd like to quickly introduce a house band to you. This is my dear friend of the, about 20 years now, I think. Mr. Garrick Burnett. Yeah. Garrick like the ball player, uh, Lou Garrick. I met Garrick yeah. when I was on staff. I was actually the, the PC technician on staff at the Union Rescue Mission in Los Angeles. And Garrick was a resident there. And they had very strict rules that we weren't supposed to have any kind of personal friendships with the residents. But they had a, a church service once a week and we ended up playing for that service. He was the piano player for the service and I was asked to play trumpet and we ended up connecting and we've been friends ever since. This is very good. Like, like the name, like the ball player Lou Gehrig. And my dear friend, my former student Michael Grigsby, who's graduated to be full time professional uh, on bass. How about a hand for Michael Grigsby? Nice guy. Nice. My dear friend, the first person I ever camped with when I ever came to Tucson. Uh, he was at Sullivan Steakhouse and he was kind enough to invite me to sit in. And we've been friends ever since. We, we did a stint at the Old Pueblo Grill. How many people remember the Old Pueblo Grill? Yeah. A few of you do. Yeah. So, you know, that was the, the established jam session on Sundays for many, many years. Pete Swan ran it. I was a regular soloist on rotation. And when Pete Swan said that he had to leave because since he couldn't change his hairstyle, he was going to change his venue. <laughs> um, so he left, he, that left Roscoe in charge. Roscoe took over and he hired the rest of us. We, we played there with the Roscoe Freund Jazz... Uh, jazz Forum. Jazz Forum, thank you. Roscoe Freund so Jazz Forum. Jazz and uh, that, that went on for it like almost a year. Two years. Two years. I take it back. Two years. But prior to that, Roscoe and I and Malik had played in a band together at Cafe Passe. I mean, it, was, it was called the Windrose Quartet. So we, and we played there every Wednesday. So coming here is a special thing. Um, in case you want to know why we're asking for donations, we, re we are renting this space. We're not getting paid. We rent the space by the hour, but we're trying to do something special for the community. And uh, we really appreciate you coming and being part of it. We're going to keep it going as long as we can afford to do so. So. Uh, Gary requested one of my favorite Freddie Hubbard tunes entitled Little Sunflower. And I think everybody knows it, so that's another reason for us to do it. So here's a tune I'll never get tired of. I heard it at Freddie Hubbard's funeral at Harrison and Ross in Los Angeles, played by Stevie Wonder and James Fowler and other people that were present at the funeral and were lost. But this is one of the great contributions the late great cover player Freddie Hubbard made to the jazz pantheon. And I love the way Gary plays it. It's entitled Little Sunflower. Again, you're all invited to play if you brought your instrument. There's no sign-up sheet. You don't have to ask anybody. Just take out your horn and feel free to play along with us. Singers can play too.
If that wasn't enough for you, let's do a little more. <laughs> We're here at 31 East. East. Thank you, Thank you very much. 31. That was Little Sunflower by the late great trumpet player Freddie Hubbard. East Tool. I feel obligated that we should take at least one break. It's a two hour thing that we do. We're done at 10, but we should still take a break, even if it's a short break, just so we can mingle and visit and encourage players that might have wanted to get up, but they haven't uh, asked yet or whatever. All right, so we too shall take a break, but come right back. We'll go, we're only taking a short break. We're going to continue right here. There's no alcoholic drink, just sodas, so help yourself. We're going to continue showing this broadcast, courtesy of the Connecting Culture Show. My name is Eddie Rodriguez. We'll be back in just a few minutes. Tell your friends, if you haven't... Uh, Told them yet to tune in. We'll be right back in about 10 minutes. Is it on? Yeah. Oh, hi. I thought I'd get here a little early because me, Glenn, and this is our videographer, uh, Eddie Rodriguez. Uh, we're going to be at the Solar Culture tonight, uh, 31 East Tool. I believe it's on Tool and Stone between 8 and 10. And this is in Tucson, Arizona. Wow, this is our second time and every Monday we make this place light up. It's no telling who shows up and this is eclectic. That means this is no jazz, it's not gospel, this is all things. Last week they played spoons. So it's no telling who's going to be doing this. Eddie's helping me out because you know I am legally blind, crippled, and crazy. I don't even know what I'm doing. But they're going to lead me and guide me and you know the Lord's going to lead me too. So, come on down. 31 East Tool at the Solar Culture. This is the Eclectic Jazz Jam, and my name is Garrett Burnett, and I approve this message. Be blessed. <laughs> that the image right there. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the Solar Culture Center, 31 East Tool. Tonight, they're having a nice jam session here. You're all welcome to come down, to Tucsonans. We're here uh, doing this and uh, you know to, to to keep jazz alive so there are people here tonight like mr malik al kabir uh mr garrick burnett uh all, also uh mr grisby on bass and a few others mr glendon gross will also be here and uh i'm here mr eddie rodriguez so we're all welcome to come down there's a five dollar charge of the donation actually there's but but you can still come in many people are invited you don't have to pay if you don't have it but Come on down, because it's a, an electric jam of nice, beautiful jazz. Everybody's welcome to come and bring their own instruments. Come down here. There's a few people coming down and, and uh, coming over to the jazz session right now. Come on down. Thank you. Enjoy yourselves, ladies and gentlemen. That's what I'm talking about. So everyone is welcome. Come on down again. Solar Culture at 31 East Tool. We're waiting to see you. <laughs> 